Hi guys, I am in my laundry room and I am about to show you two of my favorite wines and I am going to review them for you and uh, I already have my notes here and that's what we are going to do and don't mind the setting, okay? And the explanation of why I am in my laundry room, my son is sleeping, my husband is watching TV and I don't want to bother them or hear the TV, okay? So let me show you. First one, we are going to open the one that I told you about. Uh, this one is Culitos Merlot. Look at the funny label. This one is from Chile. And then we are going to open the Apotic Dark. And this one is a red blend. Bold, but it's bold, okay? So this one is from California. Now, I wanted to open them on camera because I don't know, but I love the sound when I open a wine bottle. So let's open it. Let's open the Culitos Merlot first. And if you wonder where you can buy this one, you just go to the link that I'm going to provide on the description box and you will have some options. Listen. Isn't that heavenly? I love, love, love that sound. Okay, let me start talking about the wine because that's what you are here for. And um, this one is from Chile, like I said. In the website I found that it's good with beef, lamb, and veal. And I didn't know what was veal. I had to find on the internet. It's a baby cow or calf, which is, uh, that is not mature yet. And here is the color. It's like, a, I don't know. It's not too dark. It's like a type of sangria color. That's what I will compare to. Here is the bottle again. So I'm going to let it breathe a little and I'm gonna talk about it. Uh, the first time that I taste this wine was in Puerto Rico. It was recommended by my mom. She is not a wine drinker, but she bought it for a party and my cousin loved it. She drinks wine just like me. She loves wine. And my mom told me, um, why don't you try it? I said, okay. But I don't like Merlot, I, I said to her. And she said, oh, okay. But anyway, I said, okay, let's try it. Don't worry, I'll drink it, whatever. Let me tell you. First, the funny label. Culito means ass in, in, in Spanish. It's culo, culito, ass, or bot. Um, this has a fruity, sweet, and light grape juice flavor vibe. That's what I said right away. And I think it will be great to make sangria because sangria is always very very sweet and my review headline the sweetest merlot ever for me in my in my experience drinking wine so looks like this let's try it goodness you guys saw i just opened this is so amazing and it's not expensive at all 
max you will pay for this ten dollars max okay in the back you have like a word that says full body no buts about it grapefruit finish un cuerpo lleno pero no demasiado y un final lleno de frutas amazing it's just amazing i don't know how to say you have to try it now next let's go with the apotic dark which i think is my latest favorite i tried dark because my husband bought it for me and i love the label apotic ones have the best label ever such a great detail so you know they are so gothic look this is from california 2019 the i don't know if this one has any any um date but it's 2020 2020 um 12.5 volume i forgot to tell you the apotic dark has 13.9 volume and it's i like i said 2019 let's open it also if you love the dark cork el corcho negro you need to buy <laughs> this one i will show you the cork i love it of course i have a wine opener like an electric one but no i am enjoying this lately I love that sound so look at it it says the word apotic and you have the website apotic.com that's where you find where to buy okay this for this one this one says um inspired in apoteca mysterious mysterious place where some of the earliest wine was blended and stored so that's why they are called like that um let's pour it in the wine glass another one that is not so dark it's like a but of course if you drink red wine careful careful with the carpets and the clothing okay so with this one i wrote what the wine is made of and also a couple of notes let this let's let it uh breathe here as you can see is more darker than the culitos so this one is uh it has blueberry blackberry and check this out notes of coffee and dark chocolate also is good with red meat creamy cheese and cheesy pasta imagine a cheesy pasta alfredo or with astiago cheese something like that amazing mm, the pasta from outback with the shrimps oh my god this has a bold taste and it's full body let's give it a try Oh, there you go there you go this one is stronger you can feel the spiciness 
but it's like so in the chocolate side so good and you feel that burning sensation that of course you are not gonna feel the burning sensation at all with the culitos mm -mm. but with this one you will feel it so there you go guys dark apotic very very opposite sides and of course if you are wondering if this is dry no i think it's in the on the edge of dry and and smooth so if you're like me that like that spiciness in the wine dark but if you really want to have a smooth sip of wine like a fruity type of wine try it you will not regret, regret it okay try the culitos of course you can follow me instagram facebook fan page tiktok twitter here if you like this video that will really 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 help my channel i hope you are enjoying my content and i will see you in the next video bye